welcome back to my channel. It's Beauty Passion. So, it's Sucker Free Saturday. Sucker Free Saturday. Yes. So, listen, y'all. I want to address a hate comment in this video because if y'all leave stupid comments and dumb comments and hateful comments, I'm going to expose you. So be mindful of what you say in my comment section. Most of the time I delete them. Sometimes I expose you. So today I'm exposing this person right here. But first, before I get started with this video, I need you to like my video. I need you to like my video right now because you already know it's going to be great. And if you are not subscribed to my channel, who better? Who better? Ain't nobody better than Beauty Passion. Nobody. All right, let's get started with this hate comment. I'm trying to decide, should I say this person's name or not? Let's see. Um, I'm going to say this person's name, okay? So this comment is from Liz Z. This is what she said. You probably the reason why he seemed down while in California. And when he got back home, you obviously wanted his attention and now you got it. Here's your 15 minutes. That man is minding his business and obviously don't have And you obviously don't have any. You're no better than DJ Academy. Pure jealousy. He's tired of y'all nobody speaking on shit y'all don't know. <laughs> this is what I'm talking about, about his crazy cult fans and so-called supporters. First of all, let's start. Let me dissect this. Let me dissect this comment for y'all. You're probably the reason why he seemed down white in California. If y'all watched his vlog and his Instagram, he said he was frustrated with his music or he was frustrated recording a song. That's all he said. He said, I'm frustrated about the song. I'm trying to get it out for y'all. I got a lot of stuff to do. I got to get back to the ATL. He was frustrated about his song. You don't know what happened behind the scenes. Maybe he was frustrated because he couldn't come up with a good second hook. We don't know what he was frustrated about. He's an artist. Artists get frustrated. Anything could go wrong. A software could, could glitch, malfunction. A producer could not show up. He could not be in the right head space because other life things is going on. What do that got to do with beauty passion? I'm just being honest. What do they got to do with Blue Beauty Passion? I never went and sought out our mom for nothing. His fans slash supporters went and sought him out and showed him a video that was on my channel. I never DM'd him, did nothing to this man. I am over here in YouTube world doing content. What do I got to do with him being down in California? I'm so confused. The time frame don't even add up. Our, my comment, his comment, that don't even, if he was in California during that time, that didn't have nothing to do with me at all. All I did was respond to his comment. That's all. He responded to my video. I responded to his comment. Done. I have nothing to do with the way our mind life is going, whether it's good or bad. And he, nobody should have effect over that but himself. You should not let anybody affect your life. Things happen, work it out, move on. But for this crazy fan to say, I'm the reason why he was down in, in California is absurd. Okay. Next stupid comment. I mean, next stupid line. You obviously wanted attention from who? From who? I got on YouTube and I do I do videos. I don't never, I don't care if nobody ever see my video. I am on YouTube working. <laughs> I'm on YouTube working. I work on YouTube, I work on Facebook, and I work on TikTok. 
Those are the platforms I work on. I work on all these platforms, Instagram too. What are y'all talking about? I wanted his attention. I'm putting up videos that I like him and Regine. So if the attention is, oh, I'm glad your, your content is positive. You like us. That's different. But I'm not seeking attention from nobody. Um, This man is minding his business. Me too. Me too, shawty. Shawty, I'm over here mad at my business. I'm getting up. I'm working. I'm fine. I'm having a very great Saturday. How about your Saturday? I'm doing, I'm doing just gravy. I don't know why you will be in the comments talking about he managed his business. Yeah, me too. Beauty passion. Been managing her business for a long time now. All right. You're no better than DJ Academy. DJ Academics got on his platform and said what he felt about Armand and how he felt about Regine dating Armand. My content is nothing like that. What DJ Academics said ain't nothing compared to my content. I ain't never got up here and said nothing close to what DJ Academics said. So I don't know what she's talking about. Pure jealousy. Why would I be jealous of a 25-year-old boy and a 23-year-old girl? I'm just being real honest. Why would I be jealous of them? Help me out, somebody. Why would I be jealous of some kids, some young adults? I ain't going to keep calling them kids. They young adults. Why would I be jealous of some young adults? I'm so confused by that. I'm, that's what I'm saying. His fans, I ain't going to say all of y'all, but y'all losing it. Like, what would make a person even think that I'm jealous of some young adults? That don't even make sense. All right. He tired of all y'all nobody speaking on shit y'all don't know. Who? Who? Because when I'm doing my videos, if I don't know something, I ask y'all. Hey, tell me how this happened. Hey, tell me what happened then. Hey, can y'all tell me that? Because I don't know nothing about that. I made it clear to y'all that the only person that I really have been following is Regine. And that's because she was on reality TV. Other than that, I already told y'all that I really didn't know anything about Armand until she really he really started dating Regine. So what are you talking about? When I say something, first of all, I've done a lot of, I've done, a, 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 I ain't going to say a lot of research, but I've done enough research because I started watching them at the beginning of their relationship. So when if it's something that I don't know, I say, listen, I don't know. Or if I do say something that I, I thought I knew or whatever, y'all misconcepted it wrong, y'all misconstrued it, whatever it goes on, I do say, okay, I'm sorry. I didn't know that. I'm a woman. Like I'm a real woman. I'm sorry, I didn't know that. That takes a second. If I if I put something out there that I didn't know. If you're talking about my opinions, my observations, my reactions, those are all me. That's all me. But if I say something that I didn't know, I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna say, I'm sorry, I didn't know that. Done over with. All right. Liz Z, you didn't got your 10 minutes, honey. I hope you are proud of this comment. You look crazy in my comment section, leaving something saying, I'm the reason why anybody is doing anything in their life. I'm only, I'm only responsible for my own life. Everybody else got to be responsible for their life. I have nothing to do with nobody but beauty passion and beauty passion only. So whatever you got going on in your crazy mind and however you want to think about it, that's on you. And you really need to go and figure out some other things to do other than be on internet trolling people. Because I'm working. That's what I'm doing. I'm working. I don't know what you're doing. I'm working. All right. I ain't giving that no more energy. That comment can go to hell respectfully. All right. Thank you all for watching. Let me know how you feel about her comments in the comment section below. 
I'm dropping a lot of videos today. I got y'all. I got videos, 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 videos. And I got some for tomorrow. I'm already planning out my next two days. So I know it's happy Halloween weekend. Happy Halloween weekend. What y'all gonna be? It's a lot of... Y'all seen Lizzo? <laughs> hey, Lizzo costume is funny as hell. Lizzo is Krishan. She was Krishan. She did Krishan costume so good. And she even acted her out. That was funny as hell. It's on, I think, the Shade Room or either Hollywood Lot. They put her up there uh, with her doing her impersonation of Krishan. That's funny. I didn't even see nobody really impersonating her. That's crazy. How people be thinking about characters that we don't even think about. I guess you could say she a character. So, wow. All right. I hope everybody have a great Saturday. And I'll talk to y'all a little bit later. Hecky now, Joe. It's Beauty Passion, and I'm out.